What's up boys? Back with some more Solar Survivors. I'm going to try out the Chakram loadout again because I got a legendary upgrade for it last time that made it really weird and kind of hard to play. So I'm going to try and do it a bit better this time. Let's grab... I don't think cooldown is super relevant on it since it lasts a pretty long time after it comes out. So I might want to get that eventually, but don't think it's super necessary for the weapon. I think they might actually just last until they run out of pierces available to them. Um, I could grab that for some survivability. The build is fairly short range, so that might be helpful. And I can crash into stuff if necessary. So Invert will give two projectiles at max level. I'll probably want that. And then also the Heat Seeker, I think, will give some fire rate, which might be useful. Let's see, that has five pierces by default. So the plus one from the max level blaster isn't that strong, like it is with a lot of weapons. I definitely want to get some more AoE on the chakrams. Crash into those to kill them a bit faster. The dark core I probably want for the conversion at level 5 combined with all the goodies it gives. So let's go ahead and grab that. It'll be useless until I get level 5 though. Not sure I want to take too much damage trying to kill those guys. Fire rate is an important one, so let's grab that. One of the levels on the chakra makes it spin faster based on its fire rate. So you definitely want that passive. Cooldowns... I want the HP thing and then probably the bullets. So I don't have slots for the cooldown I think. My damage is kind of bad, well the AoE is, damage is okay, I just can't really hit anything with it. So Blaster, probably not that useful here. Actually I should probably go for the back one so the invert hits a bit better as well. My damage on this guy is going to be very bad. And then I can't even hit those middle range guys. Legendary... I think I got homing on the Chakram last time and that's what made it really bad. That? Actually, could be interesting. But I kind of want to get the plus size stuff for it to make it easier to hit with it. Plus two weapon slots. Uh, there we go, 100% size and damage, but less bullets. Sounds very cool for that. Make it a lot easier to hit with it. Grab the plus one bullet here.
I don't think I want any of these. Guess I'll probably reroll here. I do have that already, so I can put a level into that. Yeah, AoE's kind of bad, gonna miss a lot of enemy kills on this run. If I can get that up to level 5, that's going to be a pretty big boost to convert the chakrams and give them a bunch of passive boosts. There we go, fire rate applies to the rotation speed, and 25% on top of that. My AoE clear looking pretty rough. Legendary. These are pretty bad. These are pretty bad. I guess passive slots. Would have loved to have the plus 50% AoE size as well. Or at least some fire rate would have been cool. All cooldowns. Let's push the HP a bit. I'm getting pretty low here. And that also lowers my cooldowns a bit. I still don't have the third weapon. Heatseeker gets fire rate at max level, so that's pretty useful. Man, Chakram seems bad as a main weapon, Jesus. Just no AoE clear. Fire rate's pretty good. Kinda wanna get the Dark Core maxed out for the conversion. Grab the damage here, probably. I don't really want any of these, but I guess I can grab some XP. Since I'll have a ton of passives to level up now with the plus 999. Grab the fire rates for extra spin speed. Grab the heat seeker. That'll give me a bit more range damage as well.
grab the Dark Core one more level and that'll be a pretty big upgrade. Legendary... Wait, no, I think it was this one that I got that made it really bad. And then it just bounced around the screen. I have to take one of these. Um, that might be okay at this point. I guess I'll try it. It's gonna take forever to get my upgrades, but I do have a lot of stuff to level, so I should get decent value out of the 50% XP. But now I can't see what anything does. Can't even see what I'm applying to. Looks like I have a lot more chakrams now, so it looks like I did get the extra bullet thing and applied to that, which is pretty lucky, though. Either that or I leveled up the chakram itself and that gave it some bullets there. Looks like we got the blaster as the fourth weapon, that's not too bad. At max level that gives plus one piercing to everything. No idea what I'm applying that to, or even what it's doing. Legendary, that is really bad not being able to see the legendary loot. There are a lot of these that could actually brick the build at this point. If you get like a bad downside to a weapon that it doesn't really work with. It looks like I got fire rate on the chakram, I think. Which is actually very good. Huh. Seems to be spinning way faster now. E even more legendaries, wow. 
Oh god. I just broke the build. I have one chakram that's flying around randomly. What happened? No, why? How could this happen? My build is dead. Wow. I've never gotten five or six legendaries before? That would have been so good if I didn't kill my build by not being able to see upgrades. This has got to be the worst six legendary run ever. Capping my chakra that I invested everything into to one bullet that moves around randomly. grab some healing, but oh well. I have a ton of levels to get still. That's gotta be like the longest list of items in this game ever. Plus 999 passives, plus one weapon, and then like six legendaries or something. I guess I'm applying a ton of upgrades to the useless shock from still.
trying to see what levels those all are. I guess they would all be over here. I have so many I can't even see them all. It's not letting me scroll down with the scroll wheel or anything. Yeah, that's capped at one bullet. Those have pretty high damage though. And a lot of piercing. Couldn't get level 10 though. My damage doesn't seem too bad here. This has got to be the strangest build I've ever had in this game though. You would think having like six legendaries would just be completely busted, but nope. And now I get even more. I did get a lot of achievements though. Some new shop stuff to buy. Let's see what we got here. Fashion. Fire rate by 10%. Looks like that's it for now. Still need to get it to level 10. Probably just unlocks that weapon to buy, but it's kind of a crappy weapon, so I might not even want that. But that's going to be it for now. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.